Hi everyone, uh, welcome back. My name is Khalid and today I'm going to show everyone the second part of the guideline tutorial. So go to File, Open, and then click on Guidelines PSD file and open up the guideline PSD file. Once you've done that, press Control Shift N to create a new layer. So in your layers palette, you have a uh, layer one created. Then go up to your rectangle marquee tool and uh, select the outer edges or right in, in, in between the guidelines and draw out a rectangle. This will be filled in with the color black. Control D to deselect. Control Shift N to create a new layer. Control D to deselect again. Try again because I went over the line. And then right click within the rectangle, choose Fill, Color. It's going to be black. then again uh, I zoomed in to the document to zoom into the document just press the control key and hold it down and press the plus key on your keyboard plus or minus key on your keyboard control shift N to create a new layer fill and we're going to fill that with black Control Shift N to create a new layer. And then fill with the color black. Control Shift N to create another layer for the footer. Zoom into this. Actually, uh, Control D to deselect. And then fill, fill that with the color black. And then Control minus to actually uh, go back and delete that. Zoom in. There we go. Control, uh, I mean, right click. Sorry. Right click, fill, and click OK. Control D to deselect. And uh, so far, you have your header, your navigation, your links box, your uh, main content area, and your footer. Now we want to add some styles to these. Um, rectangles so click on layer one choose blending options choose a gradient I'm going to use a gradient that I created earlier and uh, choose blending options for the second layer and then for the third layer going to use this blue dark blue to light blue and I'm also going to change the blend mode to multiply and then add a uh, pattern overlay to it and I'm going to use this uh, granite 128 by 128 pixels grayscale gray mode and then just right click on layer 3 choose uh, copy layer and then 
paste layer style and then for your uh, for your footer go to blending options and click on grading overlay and choose this dark uh, gray to light gray uh, gradient and then you might want to add uh, this effect control shift and to create a new layer uh, control make sure you have layer 5 selected press control hold down control and left click that way you have these marching ants around your rectangle then select layer 6 choose the gradient tool make sure your foreground is uh, black so press the X button on your keyboard and then choose choose uh, it's called transparent stripes make sure layer 6 is selected and there you have it we have some nice transparent stripes and you might want to add maybe a blending options to it add a stroke of one make sure it's in the inside and you can set the stroke to a uh, white color and then change the opacity down to about 25 pixels uh, 25 percent okay and once that's done you pretty much have yourself a good looking website let me zoom in or zoom out and show you what it looks like so far so that's what it looks like so far um, if you have any questions please post uh, any comments suggestions uh, thank you so much for watching and have a great day bye bye